Alright, and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And today, we are going into the Temple of Time. Everyone put your smiling faces on and your happy-go-lucky attitude because we're actually finally going to continue the storyline. And if we use this little mask, we can actually talk to these stones, I've noticed. Responding to your mask, this strange stone statue talks to you. I overheard this. They say that it is against the rules to use glasses at the treasure chest shop in Hyrule Castle Town Market. <gasps> Whoa, I didn't know that. Alright, well let's go into the Temple of Time. Oh man, look at it. Just look how beautiful it is. Ugh, it's like a church. <laughs> I guess it is a temple, so I guess it is kind of church-ish. Temple of Time, yes. I wonder what we do there. Okay, let me go. Alright. So, these look like a strange place to put the three stones that I have collected. Let's go ahead and play the song that Zelda taught us. Um, if I can remember how to do it. Do, 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 nope. Do, 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 do. There we go. We must play the song of time. And what happens when we play the Song of Time? Well, Navi gets in the way. Get out of here, Navi. We don't need you right now. The three spiritual stones magically float in, uh, on top of our head and in a circle, and then they place themselves on the pedestal. Oh, that's, that's crazy. It's magic. It's witchcraft. I do not believe in such a thing. There is the Triforce. What could be inside? What what magic thing must they be hiding in the Temple of Time where I have to travel across Hyrule and collect three magical stones? There's spiritual stones. What what is that? What could that be? Link, isn't that? What is it, Navi? Could it be? It's a legendary blade. The Master Sword! Oh my gosh! It's no, there's no way that this could be the actual... No, I don't believe it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it in all its glory. Oh my gosh. This is like... Exciting. Oh, man. The ancient sages. Ages ago, we ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the entrance to the sacred realm. This is the Chamber of Sages, inside the light of the Temple of Light. The Temple of Light, situated in the very center of the sacred realm, is the last stronghold against Ganondorf's evil forces. The Master Sword 
the evil, destroying sword that you pulled out of the pedestal of time was the final key to the sacred realm. Link, don't be alarmed. Look at yourself. What would alarm us? Oh, 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 oh what? Whoa. Whoa. That would be really weird, though, to... <laughs> To have fallen asleep as a child and then to wake up as I would have, I'm assuming that he's only a teenager. Um based on the age, but you know. Look, Link, you're big now. You've grown up. The Master Sword is a sacred blade which evil ones may never touch. Only one worthy of the title Hero of Time can pull it from the pedestal of time. However, you were too young to be the hero of time. Therefore, the spirit was sealed here for seven years, and now that you are old enough, the time has come for you to awaken as the hero of time. Well, do you understand your destiny? But remember, though you opened the door of time in the name of peace, Ganondorf, the Gerudo King of Thieves, used to enter this forbidden sacred realm. He obtained the Triforce from the Temple of Light, and with its power, he became the King of Evil. His evil power radiated from the Temples of Hyrule, and in seven short years, it transformed Hyrule into a world of monsters. My power now has only little influence, even in this sacred realm. Namely, this chamber of sages, but there is still hope. The power of the sages remains when the power of all the sages is awakened. The sages' seal will contain all of the evil power in the void of the realm. I, Reruru, <laughs> am one of the sages, and your power to fight together with the sages makes you the hero of time. The hero of time chosen by the Master Sword. Keep my spirit with you, and find the power of the other sages and add their might to your own. So that we, now we have his power. Find the other sages and save Hyrule. So now instead of finding spiritual stones, we need to find sages. That's interesting. Another, <laughs> another fetch quest, basically. Yay. Why is his nose so long? There's a long ass nose. I think we're back in the temple. I don't know. I don't know a Navi voice, so yeah. She's annoying. I don't want to be annoying for you guys. Alright, let's get out of here, Navi. Now that we're older.
So, now we know where we need to go. Basically, she was telling us, or he was telling us, mm, that we must he we have to go to Kakariko Village for some reason, but that the first temple we need to go to is the Forest Temple. So I guess next time we will work our way to figuring out how to make it to the Forest Temple. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.